Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Jasmine. I'm the creator of Styling Jazz, and I dabble in some fashion, sometimes some hair, sometimes some styling. However, today is going to be in um, a clothing call for my birthday, which was January 31st. I picked up some items from Urban Outfitters, and I also picked up some shoes from Yeezy. So without further ado, let's just go ahead and jump right into it. All right, so my first item is going to be this um, black tee right here, which just says DMX. I did pick this up in an extra large, and I got it for $12.89. Yes, it was from the sales section. We love a good sale. It was 14% off, so that's why it was so cheap as it is. But as you can see, it's very oversized. I did get all of these shirts from the men's section. You can never go wrong if you go to the men's section. As far as styling, I really think that I want to style these with um, some lace-up jeans that I got from Fashion Nova or some black coated pants that I got from um, Topshop. I think that would be really cute, especially with like my Doc Martens for a, a more like chill, grungy look in a way. So and my next item I already have, but I did reorder it in a smaller size. And for some reason, this... Um, release of this shirt seems to be in a brighter color the one i had before was a, a lot more faded so it's just this biggie shirt and it says the what if you can't tell like biggie's like one of my favorites so we will be seeing another biggie item soon but it just looks like this um i want to say i got this one for 12.89 also and it was an extra large this one was actually on sale for 19.99 so i did end up getting it even cheaper for $12.89, which, you know, the girls love. Again, you could dress this up. You could dress this down. Um, if I want to do a monochromatic look, I do have some gray jeans that I got from Target that are like a, a boot cut and has a cut out in the knee. Or I could wear it with these gray jeans that I got from Topshop. I think that would be really cute. Also, I could wear it with my docs. I have some, let's see, you can match it with the color that's in the shirt. Whatever you want. I feel like the options are very open. So, use your imagination, guys. Alright, so this is my next shirt. And it just says, Parental Advisory Explicit Content. You know, because of it, like the curse. So, this shirt was also $12.89. Like, I got a, a really good deal on these shirts. I did get it in a size XL. The original price is $35. So, $12.89 for this, I think is lit. And this is just the back of the shirt. I do have some Jordans that I think will pair really well with these. Um, I think I like the shirt with red. I think that would be really cute. White, of course. Again, you could pretty much wear any color with this because it's just, um, it's actually like a grayish color, a bluish color and white. So again, all right. So my next shirt is actually given like sleep shirt because that's how oversized it is. And it's just this TLC, um, graphic tee right here. And I really like the colors in this. It's very, um, bright which we love, especially since spring is coming up. I want to say I got this one for $12.89 also. Like, all these shirts were $12.89. And I did pick this up in the XXL. For some reason, I do like when my clothes is a little bit baggier. Like, even though I'm big, like, I feel like I'm going to wear baggy clothes too. Especially, like, with boyfriend jeans. I really like that style. So, that's why I got this in the XXL from the men's section keep it going like we we love a good men's shirt you know we still their hoodies we still their shirts it's great okay so for this next item urban pissed me off with this one so i got this biggie sweatshirt and it looks like this um really cute the reason why i got it is because i kept seeing it on my instagram like in my stories on ads so i was just like let me go to urban outfitters and see what they got on their um on their app so I picked this up, and in the back, it just looks like this. Very, very cute. However, what blows me is that they left the sensor on it. Now, if you live in a DMV, the nearest urban we have is like Tyson's and Georgetown. I hate Georgetown because they don't have parking. And I hate Tyson's because I hate driving there. So I'm going to have to do something because I want to wear this, and I need the sensor off. But yeah, the sweatshirt just looks like this. And... What's the back say? Oh, it was all a dream. So, 
again i think that's really cute i have to wear it soon because spring is coming which means uh summer will be here in no time okay so for my last item i'm so happy to show this i got a pair of foam runners i've been waiting for these to um to for the price to drop and they finally dropped on goat so i was able to scoop these up i love neutral colors like ignore the shirts that i got i love neutral colors love tans creams all that good stuff so i was very excited to get these um next to my list is definitely going to be red maybe i need that price to drop first but um if you want a pair of foam runners for me personally i do size up one whole size so i wear a men's six and i sized up and i got these in a men's seven um i did wear these all day so i could stretch them out so they won't be as tight on my foot these are the best shoes. They're very comfortable. I suggest that everybody gets them. And yeah, thank you. He might be acting a little nutty, but these are fire. I love me some Yeezys. All right, guys. So that concludes my Urban Outfitters and Adidas unboxing video. If you would like to see how I style these items, please follow me on TikTok at Stylex Jazz. I do a lot of my um, styling there, outfits of the day, outfits of the night, da -da -da, wig reviews. If I don't do it on YouTube, I'm definitely doing it on TikTok. So please follow me there. And also follow me on Instagram at underscore a different world. Just like the show. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.